All right, y'all, so remember, not only Rolling Loud is happening out here right now, right now is also Songkran and this crazy water fight that is still going on. So before we go to Rolling Loud today, I'm going to go outside and I'm going to give y'all a little scenes of these water gun fights because it is still a lot going on outside of the concert. So we're going to do the water fights and the concert. So let's go see what's going on. Y'all see, man. Y'all see what we got going on out here right now. Tell these brothers out here, Hassan Kron, get it poppin', man. It's a dope turnout, man. We walking down the street, walking down Beach Road right now. We're gonna go to Soy 8, where the real battlefield is for my last vlog, so we're gonna go. Blessings falling on me. I got weapons, need no armies. That like Tetris, you don't know me. That my fatty, you don't know me. Okay, hey now, nah, it's a new kid on the playground. So many bags on me, you would've thought I was a spray ground. Now they know I don't play around. I can hear what you're saying now. I just doubled up my flight map. Coast to coast, no, they ain't in town. I get rich, watch, then I get a sick watch. Watch me hit the top, I might make a tick tock. Left hand, right hand. Catch the latest trend, I might double up my network I've been going up now, I see the top going down If you didn't know now, I know you know now. Roll it now. If you're ready to see the baby, say hell yeah Let's use their fire. Left side and the right side. I need one fist in a fight. Light the bitches up. One fist in the motherfucking air. Y'all ready? Y'all ready? Joe, get with me. Come on. Y'all ready? Crazy. That ain't the baby. That's my baby. Here we go. One fist in the air. Light my crowd up. Light man, please. Light them up. Light them up. Viral shit. One fist in the motherfucking air. Y'all ready? I got one question for y'all, Thailand. What that is? Open up the mosh pits. Keep the fist in the air. I got Open one question for y'all. What's up? When I say I got one question for y'all, I want y'all to say what, baby? I got one question for y'all. How many of y'all need y'all some shit with some bopping? Hey! Shit, brother. Yeah, right. I got to fuck with that. <laughs> hey, fuck with that. Hold on. Hold on, nigga. Hey. That ain't the baby. That's my baby. Wait, I appreciate y'all. It ain't no more respect. Maybach me. 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 So Roll Aloud is lit right now. We waiting on Chris Brown to perform. It's been a good time so far on day two. A lot of good people, a lot of good performances. This is gonna be the last performance of the night, Chris Brown, before the end, so I'm gonna show you guys that. You having fun? Yeah. You, Mal? Little bit. Everywhere, everywhere, beautiful people. I'm here, y'all. Did y'all come here to motherfucking party or what? It's the last day of Rolling Loud. I'm gonna show you all the sights for the last day. They got Travis Scott coming up. Travis Scott is a dope performer. So we're gonna show you all the sights and sounds on the final and third day of Rolling Loud Thailand. Let's go. Just a rush. 
Chinese elephants about Australian too. Knowing that there's better days to come. Leave it in yourself and feel that you are me. You are the director, no matter what he directs shit for you. My boy in the building, how, how was your first rolling loud, man? Oh, uh, that was the wrong great experience. great experience. We got Travis Scott about to go on right now. What's up with y'all, man? So, I just wanted to address something real quick because I've been seeing it around and it's basically been saying like the YouTubers over here are trying to sell you some type of dream or try to make Thailand or Pattaya seem like it's some utopia or it's perfect and there's nothing bad about it. So, I'm just gonna address that real quick. And if I inspire you to travel or if you watching my videos, makes you interested in coming here that is dope and i am definitely glad if i can be your inspiration to want to travel or to want to see the world and that is why i started my channel but if we are being completely completely honest i don't really care if y'all travel or not i don't really care if y'all come to pattaya or not or thailand or not i always say man I would hope that people would go see the world. I've never, and you can't find videos of me telling you to come to Thailand or telling you to come to Pattaya to find a love or anything like that. I've never done it. Now, if you watch my videos and you like the vibe out here and it makes you wanna come, then that's cool. But to be honest, I don't really even get anything out of you coming here. Like, I don't get anything from the airlines when you buy your ticket. Your Airbnb is not paying me. The hotel you stay in is not paying me. None of the events that you do while you are here, I'm not getting paid. I'm not getting paid off any of the drinks you buy. I'm not getting paid off anything that you do when you come here. So I don't have a reason to sell you a dream. What am I sell? What? How can I sell you something if I'm not making anything from it? Now I may get benefit from you wanting to come here and your interest of coming here because yeah, you may watch the videos because you're interested to come here. You may get a consultation because you're interested in coming here. But once you get on that plane, I get nothing from you coming here. So I realistically don't have a reason to sell you any type of dream. Now, is Pattaya perfect? No, it's definitely not. And I've never said it was. Is anywhere perfect? No, I've been traveling around the world since I was 18 and I haven't been anywhere that was perfect. It's just, it doesn't exist. Like, of course, there's been places that I've been to where I didn't have the best experience, but I'm not gonna sit around talking bad about the people of a country or their culture just because I had a bad experience. You can also contribute to yourself having a bad experience. I've had bad experiences in countries, but some of it did have to do with how I was acting. That's why I don't speak on a lot of people's experiences out here because I don't know them well enough and I don't know what they were doing in the situation for why their situation ended up the way it is. That's why I leave it alone. Just go to the place that works for you. Thailand was not the first place I traveled to. so. I didn't even start my journey out here. So for me to be like, oh, come here, come here, come here. Like, no, it's not like that. If you are inspired to come here because of me, cool. If you want to come here and experience it, cool. If you don't, that's cool too. I'm already here at the end of the day. So it don't really matter to me. For me personally, 
if I have a bad experience somewhere or I'm like, I don't like this place, I'm just gonna leave and I'm just not gonna come back. That place will not see me anymore. Trying to sit around talking about other people's country, that's just not really a good look. I understand wanting to be real and all that, but it's just not a good look, man, you being an American and, you know, cause so a lot of that stuff comes off as like that American entitlement. And I'm just here to give y'all the information if you wanna come. If you wanna come, I can give you the information. That's also why I stay away from topics like dating and all that, cause to be real, I don't care who y'all date. I am not Steve Harvey, Tyler Perry. <laughs> bro, I am, I don't care who y'all date, bro, cause to be real, y'all are grown, bro. Date who you wanna date, do what you wanna do, bro. That is none of my business. That's why you don't never see me talking about it, cause I don't care. All in all, man, I just wanted to address that. Nowhere is perfect. Nowhere you go on earth is perfect. It's just, it's not. Blessings falling on me. I got weapons, need no army. That like Tetris, you don't know me. That my fatty, you don't know me. Okay, hey now, it's a new kid on the playground. Yo, we are now at Flex Club phone party. I haven't seen any foam yet, but I'm gonna show you guys the site of this phone party and I'm gonna show y'all the vibes and what's going on. There are a lot of people here right now for the Sankron holiday. So I'm gonna show you guys what we can possibly see here. Back in there, baby, just stay in a town. I'm on the edge, I ain't coming down. I get too high, I'm afraid of the ground. I'm young and I'm paid to play with these sounds. Ignoring the call, she's shutting that gown. Started at the top and I'm taking it down off the champagne. Took a break from the brown on the rampage. I've been giving it brown. Shotty been solid some time now. I'm on line for the wine, dying and I'm with it. Look where we started and look where we at. I can see where we at it, but I can't see me fit. Sitting on 25 reps. The pool party is lit right now. It's a great time. Always a great time. Got a phone party. We got some performances coming up as well. So I'm going to show you guys all of that. Rex just got started. No, we ain't done yet. But a new crib. That's a goddamn flex. Goddamn flex. Sign that check. Told him last year that I've been up next. Can't take calls, but I send that text. From way downtown, but the shit's still wet. Yeah, that's a guarantee. King of the city, man, they knowing that it's me. Hey, damn, me, are still doing it with ease. Cause it ain't that hard when I'm talking about me. Me and my funds. Told him I get what I want. I need my money up front. I do not do this for fun. So I've been here my whole life. I ain't seen him here once. Told him I ain't playing. They don't wanna get hurt, dog. It's about time. I'd have shown them how it works. So I've seen them in the shit, but now they out worse. So I ain't in a race if I ain't coming first, dog. That's a guarantee. King of the city, man, they knowing that it's me. Hey, damn, me, I'm still doing it with ease, cause it ain't that hard when I'm talking about me. Me and my funds, told them I get what I want. I need my money up front. I do not do this for fun. So I've been here my whole life, I ain't seen them here once. Told them I ain't playing, they don't wanna get hurt, dog. It's about time, I'd have shown them how it works. So I've seen them in the shit, but now they out worse. So I ain't in a race if I ain't coming first. We are back from the pool party. It was definitely a good vibe, man. It's so many brothers out here, and I'm meeting so many of y'all, and I've been meeting so many of y'all for the last few months and i just want to say man i'm proud of all you guys even the guys that i haven't been able to meet on your trips or whatever i'm definitely proud of you guys enjoying yourself with no drama that's definitely cool so most of this pool party is going to be on the patreon because there is no way that youtube is about to let me post 
this video in the full version. So right now it's already uploaded. There's like five or six, seven different parts that I already directly uploaded to Patreon. So they already there now and you can head on over there. Hope you enjoyed the video. Like, comment, subscribe. We out. Overseas, couple G's and expenses. Gotta get it. I've been different since the entrance.